Hello, I'm Jerry Fork. I'm going to review a tea, tea bag. This is uh, Baraka. B A R A K A. Hibiscus flavored. I've had a few different hibiscus teas, but I never can remember like, what, I'm, what I'm experiencing so much. <clears throat> um, I was just talking about this with the, one of my my work friends here, Diana, and uh, I think I, I got this from their area. Um, she says she likes the taste of hibiscus, and uh, <clears throat> I told her I had, had I've had hibiscus type stuff before, and I had no complaints. I just don't know exactly what it tastes like. I have a hibiscus flower outside my my backyard, but looking at it, you don't really realize that you can eat that or or drink a part of it or something um so <clears throat> i thought i'd go ahead and review this since i was talking talking about it <clears throat> you get it a little bit it's not real strong out of the tea bag it has kind of a little bit like a sweet smell Okay, let's brew. Let's brew some up. <clears throat> it's in a different language, so I don't know how long to steep it for. Usually it's three minutes. So I'm <clears throat> just kind of do that. So even kind of a, like a rusty I don't know if you can see it or not. See inside there? That's like a powder residue. Looks like, like fine scrapings of rust. Has that kind of appearance. Deep, deep red. <clears throat> it gets all over you. It doesn't really taste sweet just from the powder. <clears throat> Let's get this out here. Let it steep here for three minutes. <clears throat> See the color? It's almost blood blood red inside of the the glass. <sighs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Still got a couple couple minutes here.
Looks like there's only one word in a different language on here. And it probably is hibiscus. You see it right there? Can anybody read that language? Tell me what it says. One more minute. It's kind of a sweet aroma. Okay, it's been three minutes. Let's get it out of here. Stains your hand just a little bit. <clears throat> All right. Okay, yeah, I've, I've smelled this aroma before. <clears throat> the aroma to me is... <clears throat> It's not bad, but it's not fantastic either. Ooh, sour. It's got a sourness to it. A very light sweetness. <clears throat> The sourness is pretty, it's pretty big. I mean, I've, I've gotten sourness out of teas before. This is probably the biggest sour amount that I've gotten. It's not bad. It needs something though. This needs something. <clears throat> I'm thinking that. I don't think honey would go good in this. I'm gonna, just going to put some regular cane, some pure cane sugar in it. I think that there's just a partial packet here. I'm just going to put it in there. Right now, as it stands in my 1 to 5 rating system that I got going, um, I'm going to say a 3. <clears throat> It has a dryness on the uh, on the aftertaste. We've gotten that powder stuff all over. All right, let's see what we got. That's good. I mean, it's got the same flavor, only it's just a little bit sweeter. But that sourness, that partial pack of sugar I put in there didn't, it didn't uh, uh, dull out the sourness. It's still pretty big in there. <clears throat> hmm. I don't know. I should put any more in there or not. It's 
just for the sake of experimental. If you don't like your tea <clears throat> to be sour, and you would like to add a little bit more sugar to it, on that note, let's go ahead and let's add a little bit more sugar. I got a whole box, so <clears throat> let's go another partial. That probably equals a whole pack and that little bit of tea I got. It's not that much left in there. Okay, wow, okay, that's better. Um, whole packet of sugar um, along with this, at least this amount, maybe even with, you know, before you start drinking it, a whole pack of sugar might just do it for you. If you want yours to be sweet and you wanna try to dilute down that sourness that it has, um, do a whole packet of, of sugar um, it balances that it balances it out now you get a nice sweet and sour kind of an aroma kind of a taste now mm. with it with the sweetness balancing out the sourness it's not as overwhelming with sourness as it was but this is good that actually is, is so good that I'm going to just put it right over to a five. So there you go. Baraka. Hibiscus. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one. Bye. So do I have something else to say? I think I've said all about it. Yeah. And I hope that was enough to give you a good example on whether or not to, to, to be able to make a decision on whether or not to try it. But yeah, it's good. I, I like it. All right, now I'm done. See you on the next one. Bye.